My name is Ang Kai Rei and I am from Singapore. I last participated in the RoboCup Asia Pacific 2020 Challenge where I was the second runner-up in the Coast Base Rescue First Steps U12 category. I am very excited to be participating in the RoboCup Singapore 2020 Rescue First Steps U12 category. In my last RoboCup Challenge, one major problem my robot faced was the long time it took to find the deposit box. In this challenge, I solved this problem by programming my robot to rotate its path towards the deposit box. This strategy has helped reduce time wasted when searching for the deposit box. There are three main strategies I used in this RoboCup challenge. First, I programmed my robot to move to the target zones on the map where there are many objects. To do this, I used the map's XY coordinates to locate the target zone and my robot and then used the robot's gyro sensors to direct my robot to the collection zone. For example, if the target zone's Y coordinate is greater than my robot's Y coordinate, I programmed my robot to move north. If the target zone's X coordinate is greater than my robot's X coordinate, I programmed my robot to move east. If both the target zone's X and Y coordinates are greater than my robot's X coordinates, I programmed my robot to move northeast. Second, I programmed my robot to collect two red objects, two cyan objects, and two black objects so as to gain bonus points by depositing sets of red, cyan, and black objects. To do this, I created variables to count the number of red, cyan, and black objects. I programmed the robot to collect an object only when there are fewer than two objects of that color. Third, I programmed my robot to rotate towards the deposit box once it has entered into the target zone containing the deposit box. To do this, I used the robot's gyro sensors to determine which direction my robot is traveling as it enters the target zone containing the deposit box and then rotates towards where the deposit box is. For example, if my robot is moving in the direction between 65 and 115 degrees, I programmed my robot to rotate slightly anti-clockwise. I learned to use gyro sensors to direct my robot to certain sections of the map to increase its chance of collecting or depositing objects and to develop algorithms such as collecting only sets of colors to increase my score. The RoboCup Singapore Open 2020 has allowed me to gain valuable robotics competition experience and to improve my robotics and C programming skills. I was very impressed by SG5027, who was the winner in the Arcade Coast Base Rescue First Steps U19 category, 
and I hoped to learn how he was able to program his robot to find the deposit box so quickly each time. The RoboCup Challenge has been a wonderful learning experience for me, and I hope to share with others what I have learned through videos such as this. Thank you for watching!